a tease of Mike Pence. Weeks before Donald Trump's controversial conversation with Taiwan's President Tsai Ing-wen, a businesswoman claiming to be associated with the Trump Organization reportedly expressed interest in investing in luxury hotels near the island's airport. Todd on Sunday pressed Pence on how significant an issue the conviction for mishandling classified information is for the president-elect, given the emphasis Trump placed on the FBI's investigation into Hillary Clinton's use of a private email server, which led to no evidence of criminality. This was a courtesy call of the democratically elected president of Taiwan, and a call to congratulate the president-elect, Pence said Sunday on NBC's Meet the Press. Asked whether Petria's conviction for mishandling classified information would disqualify him, Pence said, it'll be the president-elect's decision about the totality of General Petrius's experience and background. He insisted that president-elect Donald Trump would honor his campaign commitment to leave Medicare and Social Security unscathed. Mike Pence then blamed partisans frustrated by the outcome of the election. On ABC's This Week Sunday, host George Stephanopoulos asked Vice President-elect Mike Pence point-blank about the tweet. President Obama is visiting the charity to thank local volunteers that are working to sign people up for the health insurance under the Affordable Care Act. For instance, President-elect Donald Trump has been called out repeatedly for lying to the American people. Thanks for viewing this tease. Sign up for the Tip Top Tech channel or search for a tease second mind on YouTube to find and then enjoy other teas.